I was, you know, 50 years old, I was in good health, I had no other signs or symptoms, so it was, it was shocking. February 20th, he was coughing, went to the doctor, was treated for pneumonia, wasn't getting better, and March 22nd, the phone call came. Um, people would say things about planning, you know, for their kid's college. And I would think, well, I'll never be able to do that. We thought we would enjoy at least a few years together here, but that wasn't meant to be. Susan Roney is one of over 200,000 Americans and over 1.6 million people annually treated for lung cancer, the number one cancer killer of both men and women worldwide, with 1.4 million deaths annually. Kathy Federick recently lost her husband, Will, to lung cancer in the prime of his life, just five months after diagnosis. Dr. Mary Reed of Roswell Park Cancer Institute. Even people who smoke cigarettes never expect to have lung cancer. It catches them off guard. They also bring this very harsh reality that they do everything they're supposed to do and they take their appointments, and they get all the treatments, they have a great clinical care and they still die from it. And so it really makes this a sense of urgency. Dr. Alex Adjay, one of the world's leading lung cancer experts, was recruited to Roswell Park from the Mayo Clinic. Dr. Adjay and his team have just created the kind of genetic screening test that doctors and lung cancer patients have sought for decades. The new test screens each patient's DNA for the presence of 14 known genetic mutations associated with lung cancer. These 14 mutations are located on just 10 chromosomes. From the genetic profile created, Roswell Park can now customize a targeted treatment plan for each patient. What makes this progress even more ideal is that the existing drugs to be used are oral medications, pills, with far fewer side effects and inconveniences as traditional chemotherapy and radiation therapy. This is the future. That's why the treatment is going. So that typically the kinds of treatments people can take and go to work and do all their daily activities and so on. Dr. Ajay says the test also takes other similar tests being offered at select top cancer centers up a notch for primary care doctors and the patients they serve. When you get the results, you're going to get the fact that these are the abnormalities we found, these are the drugs you can use, and if no drug is easily available, you get a list of the clinical trials that are available that you could uh, get your patient into. So you're going to get a result and information that you can act on. The new targeted drug approach also shows far better results for patient lifespan and quality of life. With regular chemo, uh, we see the initial sign of shrinkage after six to eight weeks. There are some of these pills you actually see results in a week. According to Dr. Ajay, Roswell Park also is in a highly unique position to offer one of the best tests yet available anywhere a test that has hardly any geographic barriers for patients and community physicians. Doctors Ajay and Reed say there's only one thing stopping the immediate use of the test for all stage three and stage four lung cancer patients in 2014, funding. We can't do it unless we have people supporting us because insurance companies don't reimburse for it. They don't really cover the costs and you know, if the difference between giving people optimal care for cancer that they could survive is a matter of money and donations, and then that's, we have to go after those donations. If you don't have any source of uh, funding to support it, then it becomes unfeasible from the financial aspect. For Roni and Federick, the test offers more than a psychological sense of hope. We have to find the funding. Not a question of we should, a question that we must. Nobody should ever have to make the choice between paying for a test and living with lung cancer. Maybe some people don't have to come to where I'm at because of this test. There's no reason not to fund it. Your support is critically needed to advance new and better lung cancer treatments. Become a partner by making a donation and 
by helping to spread the word about our promising research.